Alice is ready, and we have the road pass. So let's party up. What's going on, everyone? It's Rich Haywood here for Bacon Ice Cream Productions and Team RTFC welcoming you to yet another episode of Completion Quest. That's right, featuring Fantasy Star right here. There it is. There it is. There's Fantasy Star hanging out, ready to rock. We've got the Retron already loaded. We've got everything ready to go. We've got the map today. Yes. Yes. We've got the maps. That's right. We're going to be using some maps from Starfighter 76. Um, Shoutouts will commence from now until the end of the game for their awesome work on these maps. Uh, you can find a lot of Starfighter 76's work on GameFAQs. He's all over the place. Um, and uh, yeah, it's pretty awesome. So let's get to getting. I'm going to hit some buttons. Do, 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 do. And let's go in to some Fantasy Star on the Sega Master System. Let's go. All right, here we are. Right in the thick of things. Level 11, 1498 is the EXP total. 58 attack, 113 defense, 99 HP, 15 MP, 390 Mesitas. We've got enough to basically do everything we need to do in order to get Mayu right away. And then we have enough to go ahead and get Odin after we get Mayu. Because of course we need Mayu in order to get Odin. But we'll see that. We'll see that in a second. We've got the Game Facts guide loaded as well in our a little loady zone here. Um, <clears throat> it is by Dark Vortex, the guide we're using right now. Um there isn't necessarily a reason why or not that we're that we're doing this um, or using this particular guide. It's just one that I found. It said it was highly recommended and it looks pretty good to me. Um, it's everything that I remember from when I was used to when I used to play. So you know, I I see no other reason than to use that one. But of course, the maps, the maps are where it's at. There it is. There it is. So, and those Starfighter 76 maps are always awesome. They have a legend. They have everything you need, um, everything you need to know to get where you where you need to go in this game. So, we will be using them all the way through the game. All right, cool. So, when we last left off our little adventure here, bloop, 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 bloop. we are outside of this shop where we spoke to this dude right here. Yep, it's a second-hand shop, and we went to buy... Whoops, I hit the wrong button. Let's go back in. All right, so we talked to the second-hand shop guy, and he has Flash, Transer, and Secrets. Um, <clears throat> I don't think he'll t he'll sell us again. I don't know. Let's see. Yeah, see, like, I don't know who told you that. You had best forget it. Okay, cool. So I, I, can't, I think you can keep do doing it, but it's not. you don't need another road pass, so, like, why bother? So anyway, you have to talk to the guy three times. We did that in the previous video. We have the thing ready. We're ready to rock. Um, let me get chat up here too, just in case. Just in case there's other chats, because we are dual streaming on the YouTube and the Rumblees. All right. So here we go. And welcome in. You know, any any time you guys want to comment or whatever, uh, comments of course will be um, put right down below. You want to come in and say hi. Come on in and say hi. We are not shy sharing that stuff during these walkthroughs. All right, cool. We're going to go in, and we're going straight for the save zone. I almost made it. We got, a, we got an attack of swarm. That's fine. I got two experience points. We're going to open the chest. Um, it's three Mesitas, but whatever. It doesn't matter. All right, here we go. We have to go over here because we got to get our, our good time sleep in. All right, there we go. Um, let me see. Can we beef this up a little? It is a little. Uh, it is a little low in the sounds. Let's take let's take the sounds up a little bit. All right, there we go. That should be good. We should have our little bleeps and bloops in there. You know, you gotta have you gotta have a little bit of sound. All right, let me know down below in the comments or in the <coughs> chat, the live chat as well, 
if it is a little louder or not or whatever. So we've got the road pass, right? So road pass is in the inventory. So we should be able to talk to these dudes and go straight across, which is exactly what we want to do. Bloop, 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 bloop. You may proceed. Bam. Do do. Be do be be. Talk to the dude three times, man. You got to do it. All right. Let me talk to these guys. Long ago, a spaceship was built in the Gothic Laboratory. It's pretty cool. The governor is in peso. He rules all of Motavia. All right, that's pretty good. Do, boom, 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 boom. This is Palma Spaceport from the spaceport. You can go to peso on Motavia. Uh, obviously, this is, this is where we need to be. We can go in the shops. This is the first food shop. You can buy some things, cola, burgers. We don't need any of that yet, just yet. We're not going to be doing into the major dungeon dungeoning just yet. You can file for a passport here. Do you want a passport? Uh, yes. Have you ever done anything illegal? No. Do you currently have an illness? No. Passport fee is 100 mesitas. Will you pay it? Yes. Passport's ready? Bang. That's it. See, that was easy. Getting a road pass should have been that easy. You know? You just fill out a little bit of a form, and you're like, hey, I'm not sick, and, um... I'm not like, you know, some illegal person. And then there you go. Now you got the road pass and a passport. Boom, boom, boom. There it is. And we got a whole bunch of other stuff. Um, some of this stuff I'm holding on. So when we get Odin, I'm just going to give it to him right away. And then we're going to hopefully have enough Mesitas to get him all the other stuff that he needs uh, pretty pretty quickly. And then it's grind time. All right. The goal is to try to get them like 15... Yeah, what, what level are we at right now? 11? Yeah, 11. So at least 11 for the for Mayu and Odin. I want to get them to there. Um, and then that's that. And then we go over here. Do you have your passport? Yes. You may proceed. All right. There we go. Then we're going to get on the plane. Bound for Matavia. Going. It's time to fly. All right, there we are. We just jumped from planet to planet. We're on the new planet of Matavia, the uh, the icy, or not the icy. This is the desert planet. The icy one's the other one. Hey, okay, come on. Let me talk to this dude. There we go. Talking to the dude. Welcome to the Peso Spaceport on Matavia. We did it. We did it, guys. We flew all the way across the stars to another planet with our road pass and our passport. All right, and then we got to go over here. We're only really do here to do one thing, and then we're going to leave. We're not even going to go out there. It is said that antlions roam the desert. Well, it doesn't matter about the antlions because we're piecing out as soon as we get this going. So there we go. All right. <clears throat> there is a cake shop in the cave of Naula called Naula on Palma. All right. So apparently we're going to have to buy a cake at some point. I think, the, was it the mayor or the governor or something like that? Need, needs a cake or something? I don't know if he's sick or something. I forget, I forget exactly what the story was. But you need you need to do something. Then you go buy a cake and do all that kind of fun stuff. All right. So now it's to the right, I want to say. Let's look at the guide. Because we're going to go straight for Mayu and then just get out of here. Um, first thing you do is pay the shops a visit. No first food. That's Scion. Palma Spaceport, we already did that. Peso, it's a fairly large city. Um, you can get some cool things, but not yet. Um, so step into the shop on the right. Stop on the right. This is the shop on the right. Boom. 
I have a rare animal here. Would you pay one billion mesitas for it? No. I see you have a strange pot. Shall I trade the animal for it? Yes. I will give you one pot instead of a billion mesitas for a rare animal. All right, here you go with him. We will be fellow travelers. I'm Alice. What's your name? I'm Mayu. It's a kitty cat. Mayu, have you ever heard of a man named Odin? Yes, but he's turned to stone. If he drinks this medicine, he'll be okay. But I cannot open the bottle. Because I don't have thumbs. Well then, we better go save Odin together, okay? Yes, we better. So let's rock. And there he is. Where's Mayu? He's hanging out. It's, it's a good time. All right. So we have Mayu in the party. Let's check the statuses on the uh, the Mayus. Level one. All right. So you get everybody at level one. So it's it's hard because you know like people will like get one shot and all that kind of stuff. So you gotta you gotta ramp up your building, right? Uh, which is the other reason why you, you kind of want to like get all the party members as soon as you can, um, so that way you can just you know get the get the job done and get it all you know if they everything you need to do. Do, 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 do. But we are going straight back to Palma because we know where Odin is. Bound for Palma, getting on, yeah. Do, 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 we got the kitty cat. Now we're going to get the other guy. He's stoned. I mean, he's just made a stone. Do, 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 do. Right now. All right. Anyway. Yes. All right. Now we go down here. Come on, Mayu. You may proceed. Alright. Heal up. Blue little. We're going to save. We're going to save in slot four now. I don't know why, but we are. Nice. All right. So we have officially saved in slot four. We've got Mayu. We're ready to go. Now, I go. I don't know if we should just directly go for it. I mean, I, I'm pretty sure we can, because the cave is pretty easy. So let's do it. Let's let's go get out of it. Of course, the enemies apparently know that that Alice is the strong one and Mayu is the weak one. So they're gonna go after Mayu a lot, but that's okay. Even if Mayu doesn't make it we're gonna we're gonna do we're gonna do things and it'll be fine yeah you know, we can just go and talk to the priest and get my back it'll be all right gunsy 20 is in here saying let's do it that's right that's right we are doing it it is the month of due after all all right let's go cannot go up forward it's pitch black that's okay um Oh, that's right. We need to buy a. Um, we need to buy a flash. We need to buy a flash first. Sorry, guys. Slacking. Whoa, four scorpions. I didn't realize that there was a, that many scorpions going on here. Yeah, yeah. Stop getting. Stop hitting Mayu. All right, we're good. We're doing it. We're doing it. 
Yeah, do the 52 Mesitas. That's more than enough to buy a Flash or two. I forgot that, like, once you get more party members, I think all of this stuff starts getting more aggressive, which is okay, because then we can just do super level building. It's gonna be good. Do do do. Alright. Get the little heal in. Is this the first food? Yeah, it is. I don't think we can get that from here, though. Alright, so we don't need the first food. We need this one. Second hand shot. Flash. Um, let's get another flash just in case. Boom, 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 boom. Alright, we got the flash. We're good times there. Got the dead tree. Immediately attacking Mayu, but that's okay. Ah. Oh. Alright, we're gonna need to heal up. Double scorpion, not a big deal. Nice. Next flash use blue. All right, so. We can go and get uh, 10 Mesitas, 20 Mesitas. There's two chests that have those in there. and then Or we can just go for Odin and then get the compass. I think we're just going to go for Odin and the compass because, I mean, we can get 30 Mesitas like that because now we have Alice. So I'm not even bothering with the chest. So we chest. We go over here. And according to these awesome maps, it's all the way at the end of the hallway. You make it left. You go all the way to the end of the hallway, you make it a left, and then blam! There he is. There he is, guys. <laughs> Alright. Item. We need the Azalin use. Do 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 do. There he is. There he is. Do, 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 do. Thanks for saving me. I guess if Medusa can stop me, I don't have much hope of killing Lassic, do I? My brother died trying to kill Lassic. Before he died, he told me to seek your help. Is that so? Well, I best not let your brother die unavenged. Why did you try to kill Medusa? Because Medusa has a mystic axe. Unfortunately, she got away from me. Anyway, I have stashed a compass in one of the passages of this cave. Let's go and get it. All right. So then we can turn right around. Let's go get the compass. It's all the way at the end of this hallway. Oh, some slimes. Fire out. Oh, that's right. I should I should hook him up. I forgot. Boom, 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 boom. Mayo advanced to level. Very good. All right. So let's do items. Actually, let's status up Odin. What does he got? He has an iron axe and iron armor, but he doesn't have a shield. So let's get him a shield. So we can do the iron shield. And we can equip it on Odin. Boom. There we go. So now Odin is level one, but he's got 48 defense. So he's he's rocking. He's, he's in good shape. Um, we're, gonna, of course, going to pump up all of these numbers. 
because they're record numbers. Let's go. Do, 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 do. There's a treasure chest. Yes, I want to open it. Found the compass. Oh, wing eye. Right away. That's pretty wild. Bing. Boom. Boom, boom. Boom, 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 boom. Ugh. Yes, I want to open it. All right, awesome. So before we move any further, let's see what else we got. Okay, Medusa's Cave, um, Compass, we got that. All right, awesome. And then we got to get the short cakes. For Medusa's Cave, travel in a general until you find the, the, the town in the middle of the forest. And you can get the needle gun. Um, it's pretty cool. Uh, fight the monsters outside. Gold roof. Find a man. Dungeon key. Okay. Go to the Nala cave. Yeah, and then that's the governor. We can do that. Mahara cave. Mm -hmm. All right. So they want us to do a whole bunch of stuff. But before we do any of that, I think we're just going to... Before we go on the quest for shortcakes, I think we are going to do that grind. So, all right. Let's get on out of here. We're going to bypass all this stuff. Is C the one with the 10? Yeah, I don't need that. We can leave those in there. Boop, 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 boop. There we go. Now we got a party. Very cool, very cool. All right. So we'll go and heal up. And then we're gonna start we're gonna start grinding for um, for good stuff. Because with this handy dandy paper I have from game also from game facts not from starfighters but from for uh for something else um i've got odin's and mayu's xp charts which is pretty neat and it says that um with a lowly 850 xp we can get him to level eight in fairly short order so we can use the tried and true fishman method um, to get that, but I think we're gonna need. Um, we might need some help. Oh yeah, I forgot. We gotta save first. All right. And now we can go straight on up. Yeah, we already have, uh, was it Myers already at level two? Yeah, we're going to try out some Fishman strats right now, just to see. Get the two fish man. Oof. Oof. That's that hurts a lot. <laughs> we might need the thick fur. We might need to go and get the thick fur. Cause that that was that was rough.
All right, we got the 84. But with Mayu already done, I don't know. I mean, we're, let's let's get some more Mesitas. Whoa! Look at that. Look at that craziness right there. I just got to keep Odin alive. Because he's about to get some serious XP. <clears throat> Come on, take out one of them. One heck, one HP. Come on, finish the job. Oh, stop hitting Odin. Yeah, hit up Alice. I don't. It doesn't matter to me. Oh. I'm gonna have to think about healing soon. Come on, Odin, take take one of them out. Take one of them out. Ah, oh, he did one damage, but he did it to the wrong one. <laughs> Come on, Alice, take one of them out. Oh, terrible. I have to waste a turn just to do the heal. Now we're good. <clears throat> Whoa. Man. Man. These are... Oh, you still didn't kill them. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. Great. There's one. There's one. Finally. There's another one. Finally. Oh, man. That was getting, that was getting real brutal. This is going to be huge, though. This is going to be absolutely ginormous. Over 200 Mesitas and a and one battle level up for Odin. There, we got this. We got this. Boom. 55 XP. Odin advanced the level. We open the chest. 210 Mesitas. Let's go. Let's roll. All right, so we're going to heal up, though. All right, and then we gotta go to the priest and wake up, wake up poor Mayu. <laughs> Took one, one to the, one to the dome and just was out, it was out cold. Let's go, let's go. We gotta go down here first. I forget how much it costs to do this. Do 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 do. Mayu, forty mesitas. Okay. Do, 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 do. 43, 40, 45, 45. Alright. Easy to do. Easy to do. Eve? got the save in so I mean wait can we get the thick fur here quest for short case blah blah I'll pay for that don't bother paying for the hotel it's fine needle axe needle gun yeah they want us to buy the needle gun which you could do it's fine dungeon dungeon key we need dungeon key okay fine uh-huh Flashes, fight monsters. Until you make a thousand. But you need a thousand to buy the... Whatchamacallit. Uh, north side, the gray white one. There's the cave. 
And that's a shortcake. Okay. Yeah, the shortcake dealer. Okay, it says it costs a thousand. Peso. And peso purchases a a thick fur. All right, but wait, in peso, where is it? Where is it in peso? I guess you have to do all that other stuff first in order to get to the place where you can get the thick fur. Because I, I mean, I, I think I want to get the thick fur for, um, for Mayu. Just so that poor little cat has something, something to do. Um, I'm going to try it again, but I, I think Maya is just going to get destroyed again. Oof, she's definitely not making it. <laughs> that poor kitty's, that poor kitty's done for. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, if he gets my head one more time, it's done. Yeah, it's, he died. Okay. <laughs> so we'll try this one more time. Odin and Alice will probably get um, to where they need to be. Oh, man. That's rough. Five of them, though. Just the lure of getting that much XP and um, and Mesita is, is too great, though. We might need to do the Scorpion run for a little bit. With Mayu and party, just so just so I can get enough to get Mayu leveled up like another two or three times. So, so they, you know, so like I said, the poor cat doesn't just take a hit and just peace out. We're almost to the point where we can start getting some stuff for Odin, too. Like all that extra armor and stuff. We'll get rid of all the irons and then just go for it. It's fine. We're still in good shape. Because now we, we've got... We've got... Basically three of... Three of them almost within one hit range. And of course, you go for the one that doesn't <laughs> that has 26 hit points. That's the other thing I really wish this game had is the the ability to control like where you're targeting. Yeah, you know, because if if you can reduce the amount of hits you're going to take, you're obviously going to survive. Yeah, it doesn't matter if you hit him. Got it. Got it. Yes. Good. Good, 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 good. Alright. Magic. Heal. Odin. There we go. Swarms, no big deal to deal with. Yeah, we really should. We really should probably do this run for for a while. It's not enough. Like, it's not enough. Uh, like Mesitas or, or you know, but it's just enough XP. I think. Yeah, yeah. Poor kitty needs a buff. You're absolutely right. Um, and I wish that on Palma there was something you could get for for them, but that yeah, like there's just nothing for the the poor kitty. <clears throat> Let me just go over here. We gotta get, we gotta get Mayu back up. For seventy, forty, sixty-two. Yeah, so we'll we'll do a little bit of the the other grind because 
What's this first shop? If we can get whatever's in this first shop for Odin. Yeah, so we need 1400 for the shield. So that's that's easy to get. Let's just dip in here real quick. Yeah, Alice is over 100 hit points now. That's pretty good. I also wish that even if you were knocked out, you still got XP, XP for the, the party. I mean, I know it doesn't, you know, it's not supposed to be that way, but at the same same time, so come on, man. Give us a little. Give us a little something. So what do we got here? Mayu, getting another level. All right. We got this. the level. Nice. Yeah, so even though it's a little slower, this actually, this method might actually be the best for right now, because I can get them over the hump, and then and then I can um, keep pushing on. Let's go get a heal up real quick, so I can keep going. And then when it becomes apparent that they're going to be able to survive a little more, then we'll go back out. All right. Brian F's in here says the grind continues. You're right. We partied up, man, and now it's time to grind some more. Get, get Odin all his goodies. We're also trying to get Mayu up to level so that way we can survive going through the Fishman stage, the Fishman battles, and then not have to get annihilated every time we fight them. <clears throat> that way it prevents Mayu from getting XP, and that's no good. 
Although we do need those battles because those Mesitas are whew, the Mesitas will, will will be raining from the sky. So we got eleven seventy six. We're almost there for the shield. And then I bet you once we get the shield on them, I bet you we can sell off most of the other stuff. And we'll probably get close to four or five hundred, so that'll make it even easier to get the thousand for the sword. And then we'll run on over and get the armor. I think that's twelve hundred. And we can do all that in this one run. And then Odin and Alice will be ready to rock. They're gonna they're gonna be good to go. Um, and then Maya is next, and then we'll start doing story for next time. And we'll see what happens. Maybe I'll be able to do some later today. I don't know. You know, I got a good hour and something. Everybody's taking naps, so I can so I can play and do all this stuff, which is good. They say they want me to go... I'm gonna go over here to Epi. Wing eyes galore. As you enter, armory... Unless you need the healing. I guess that's actually not bad. Ooh. There we go, there's one back down. So I healed up my. Uh... There we go. That's that's better. I might actually buy a transer. The transers, uh, they transport you to the last church you visited, which the only one that I've ever visited is back in the town where we get the free uh, health. Ooh, nice. Very good. Double double heal. Oh, 252 Mesitas, but who took that damage? That was good. That's actually good. All right, so uh, I don't know. I think it was Odin that took that. All right, so we can heal up on you. That's okay. All right. So what's in here? Oh, this is the armory. This is where they want us to buy the needle gun. We might come back for that later. The cool thing about the needle gun is it does all of the different um it hits every enemy for five XP exactly every time with one hundred percent accuracy. Um so it's pretty cool. But you know, for like the whereabats, I mean, you know, you don't deal with five damage to something that has fifty HP, who cares? But the the swarms, oh man, that could make short work of them. It'll be uh, and it's pretty cool. Anyway. All right. There's a house with a gold roof inside. You find an old man. Search for a dungeon key. Confirm that it'll tell you. Hidden one in the warehouse in Kenamit. Kamenit. Uh, with that information, return to Kamenit. You find the gray building at the northeast corner of town. Oh, wait. Oh. Oh. 
Okay. So you have to unlock it. All right, so let's go to the gold roof house, which is that one. Okay, cool. Welcome to Epi. What's up, Epi? All right. Yes. I've hidden a dungeon key in the warehouse in the outskirts of Kanamit. Cool. Thanks. Um, you know what? I think I will while I'm here. You know what? I'm just gonna buy it. I know. I know. I have enough to get the other thing, but. We'll get the needle gun. Um, uh, should I equip it on Odin now? Yeah, you know what? Let's let's give him the let's give him the needle gun. Let's give Odin the gun. All right. Uh, let's go around this way. Stay in the grass. So, done. Yeah, we're gonna hit hit five 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 right there. Boom. See, it's not bad. It's not bad. So, I mean, as soon as I can get him the bigger weapon, though, I'm totally changing. That's that. That's what's gonna happen. <clears throat> All right. A little heal up. Now we're looking pretty good. Forty-two, sixty, one eleven. And then we still need to get to, what is it? I think it's 1400 for whatever this is. Yeah. We still need 1400 for the shield. But we did that. But we're in Kanamit right now. We can go back in here. Dungeon key. Got the dungeon key. Mm, 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 mm. mm, 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 mm. Alright, so we're, we're still doing things. We're still getting things done. Even in the story. Which is pretty awesome. We'll save one more time because I have the dungeon key in the inventory now. So it's not just a complete grind fest. We we are still like moving towards some goals. What does the god want me to do now? All right, so we got that, we got that, and then from the entrance, blah blah blah. Um, before leaving, good amount of burgers, a few flashes, back outside, fight monsters until you get a thousand, uh, whatever, and then that's before I go to the Nala Cave. Okay, so the Nala Cave is on the the outskirts. I'll show you where it, where it is. Um, but we're not going to go there just yet. Welcome on in, everyone that's just hanging out and chilling. Feel free to say hi. We'll be sure to highlight your message and then, you know, of course, show it during the replay. I wish I could give the gun to Mayu. That would have been awesome. I mean, obviously, Cat doesn't have thumbs, but how cool would that be? Just to, just equip Mayu with the needle gun and have Odin and Alice just going ham on ham with swords. That would be sweet. <clears throat> but it is cool. It's like 100% effective. There's no question you will get a hit with the, the needle gun. 
Uh, there's two more. There's like a, I don't know, is it like a nail gun and then a laser gun or something like that? So one does five, five guaranteed damage. One does ten guaranteed damage. One, oh shoot, I should never run. Um, one does uh, fifteen guaranteed damage. Uh, at the end of the game, like the, that's the laser gun or whatever it is. I actually have that information here somewhere. But right now, this is just Grindfest City here. With some scorpions. There we go. Nice. Very good, very good, very good. 52. So this is all this this is all basically just to help out Mayu, to to be honest. Cause I'm as soon as I get the shield, I'm pretty much done worrying about Odin being able to survive attacks in the fishman. Um But if I can get Mayu to five or six, I think it might it might be irrelevant. The defense stats on Mayu might just be big enough. Defense value at level 8 is 53, so that should be just enough to just get it done. I mean, that makes things like that quicker. What have we got here? Up to 1,400 yet? Almost. Just, just, just. Um. Da ding, 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 ding. Take that, swarms. Yeah. That's a good time. Nice. Maya went up another level, which is great. Ah, uh, who took the who took the damage? It's probably Maya. Alright. Oh. It's almost a waste of time. It's like two and three, right? Oh, and a double damage. That's fine. It wasn't that bad. That's rough, though, man. That's rough. Man, these swarms. It used to be like Scorpion City. But I think now that the game knows that like your party can handle it, they just throw the chumps at you. There we go. Yeah. Give me the scorpions. I can handle it. Yeah. Okay, so let's see where we're at now. 1403. Just, just there. Loving it. Uh, 2300? Where's Alice? Where do you need to be at? 2200. Yeah, Alice is almost at level 13, which is pretty cool. Odin got a level. We're liking that. So let's go to... Let's go to check out where the party is about... We're almost at the hour, so let's just do a quick check at where we are now. We're still going to play, but where are we? Status. Alice is level 12 officially. 
got the 14, got the uh, the Zero armor, the ceramic shield and the ceramic sword, which is exactly what Odin's about to get. Because I did the look. And, um... Alright, we got level 5 on Mayu. Level 6 on Odin. Yeah, and that's because Mayu just kept getting destroyed, so... Um... Okay, we're good. We're good there. Which should be fine. Alright. And now we have enough for the shield. So let's get rid of that. And then we can go to the secondhand shop and start selling some stuff off. Bing, ba -ding, ba -ding. Ceramic shield. Thank you. Boom, boom, boom. Item. Ceramic shield. Equip. Oh, damage. Got it. All right. Now let's go to the secondhand shop. Sell. We don't need the sword sword. Sure. Leather shield. Sounds good. Leather armor. I'm going to get rid of this iron sword. So it's a tough bargain. Um, we're gonna get rid of the iron. Is the iron axe? Yeah, the iron axe is nowhere near even the iron sword. So we're gonna get rid of the axe too. All right. And we'll get rid of this iron shield. Yeah. Hmm. All right. Cool. So. Um, so we've got the flash, the compass, the passport, the dungeon key, all the, all the critical items. And we're already back up at 388 Mesitas. we got to get to 1200 or something like that. So that's, that'll be kind of cool. I said, Webfleet says, I don't know what this is and I never saw this, but I will sub and like, because you see him like small YouTube account. Well, thanks man. Thanks for coming on and visiting. And uh, and yeah, yeah, we are we are we are a little 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 tiny guy just over the the thousand mark. Yeah, but we're playing some Fantasy Star on Sega Master System, man. We're playing through the whole game in different streams. So hope you guys like it and check it out. And thanks, thanks for everything. All right, so we are back into this. Um, actually, let's go let's go and get to the uh, after we fight the Scorpion. You know what? I'm gonna go to the other shop and find out. How much we need for whatever they had, and which and what it is, if it's the armor or not. Um, because I kind of want the sword for Odin, even though he's carrying an axe. Do 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 do. All right, eleven twenty for the sword, and he has it. And, and that that guy has the sword, so we're gonna go for it. We're going for the sword. Let's see if we can. It's a high risk. It's high risk, but after this swarm attack, what is my use? So he's a, Mayu is at level five. I gotta get the six eighty total experience for Mayu in order for the little kitty cat to get that next bump in defense value. But and it's only like a couple, so thirty eight to forty one. So let me see the status here on Mayu. Experience three ninety six. Got to get to six eighty. So we're not gonna get there just yet. We got we got a ways to go. We'll, we'll try it. We'll try it out. And what's Mayo's attack value now? 31? It's not bad. Probably enough to do the thing damage, that's for sure. We're gonna try it out.
Because if we can get through one, even if we have to back out and heal every time and do like the loop, it's still worth it because every time we go and do one of these fishman things, you know, like the four or five of them. Um, yeah, this is four of them. We should be able to get through this. Boom, 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 boom. See, they might not like Odin now. They're still hitting up Mayu. Boom, 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 boom. Neil Gun is pretty good. Now that one's down because of the big hit from Alice. So that reduces the amount of hits that are going to be taken. We might, we might be able to get this now and leave Mayu, Mayu in party. That's another one that's going to be down after this. Ten. Good. Boom. Boom. Nice. Nice. 168 Mesitas. Hey, I'll, I'll take this because, you know, just a couple of these gets you enough to get the sword. And then you get the sword... And then, I don't know, should I switch back or get take a guaranteed five hits? I'm not sure. Uh, my own probably need a heal. So I'm going to have to sack going for a kill to just to get Mayu healed. So I'll do that. It's fun. Mayu's healed. Boom, 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 boom. Nice. Ding, ding. Ding, 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 ding. ding. Another 168. Now we'll check to see where we're stats at. 787. A couple more of these, man. We're going to be good to go. Three of them. Boom, boom, boom. Hit them, hit them right up. That'd be, uh, that's awesome right there. I think we can still, with three of them, I can still feel safe. Where's Alice going to hit? Nice. Um, we're going to do another heal. Just so we can get the end battle heal right there. Boom, boom. That's pretty good. Keep going here. Yeah. 33. Odin goes up. Very good. Another 126. Let's see what we got here. Magic. We can heal a couple more times. Um, let's heal Odin. And then we won't need it unless Maya's in trouble. So we'll do that after that. Being able to do this is pretty clutch. Because I won't have to worry about anything now that we know that we can kind of survive through. Because each one of these things is giving you massive amounts of experience and massive amount of money. So this is the it's kind of the ultimate grind spot, even though the werebat might actually I don't know. The werebat might be better, but it's not as guaranteed. This is guaranteed. You know, if you're here and you're going through, you're gonna you're getting something that's giving you pretty much the deep, the most decent or the best XP around, um, and this might be in the game, like total, um, and you're getting Masita's 
at the wazoo so you're going to be able to afford whatever you can whatever you need so even though the guide currently thinks there's no way you're you're still at like a level five with alice right you know like you didn't you're you're not this high in level but that's just how i play rpgs so immortal sojourn gtc in the house uh saying been been running around happy i can catch you live for a change yeah man yeah welcome in welcome in Intellivision Gamer, the Intellivision Gamer. Come on in, in for the live stream. Um, yeah, thanks for being here, man. We're playing some Fantasy Star. It's getting all sorts of good stuff. Oh, I should, uh, oops, I should heal up Mayu as we're talking. It could be dangerous. It could be dangerous. Could be dangerous. There we go. Now three of them are going to go down right now. It's going to be great. As soon as Odin fires, one, two, three, four down. Nice. And then this is this is it right here. Boom. 55 XP. Alice gains a level. Yes, we want to open it. 210 Mesitas. We're good. We're good. Working some overtime, getting paid to watch. Nice. Yeah, man. There's nothing better than than having a than having a moment to to check some stuff out while you're while you're uh, you're on the on the clock, so to speak, which is great. Um, I think it's I think I needed over 1,200, but it's 65 is seated. We should get it by the time we get back. Was it 1175? I forget. Um, but we can get the sword now, so we'll see. I think we should. I love the journey to get Odin. Yeah, it, it is pretty cool. And it happens right away, so it's it's decent. <clears throat> um, getting Noah next. Um, the, it's kind of weird because it doesn't happen until, like, what is it? It's like another uh, like hour in, in regular story gameplay, not this, you know, not me running around uh, grinding it out. <clears throat> And then once you get Noah, um, you know, the good news is you get him. And the bad news is he's woefully underleveled because he comes in at level one. So then you got to go find another grind spot and like grind him up so he doesn't just get squeezed. But I think I think this one because I haven't I haven't ever done it. Um, you can you max out at level 30 and it's 60,000 XP. Um, I'm thinking I'm thinking maybe. Like through a, a whole bunch of uh, series of of uh, grinds that I'm not gonna I'll put I'll leave them live. But I'm not gonna like include them in the regular uh, completion quests. Um, when I do the big when I do the big thing, it'll just be way too long. Um, but uh, I might I might try to go for it. I might try to go for max level just to see what happens when you get to the end. Um, yeah. So we got 1242. Got um, level 13 there. And yeah, we're about to go get the sword. Let's see what the stats are for Mayu. Yeah, 31 attack, 31, 38 defense, and 44 HP. Poor Mayu, though. It's just so, like, it's always, like, not, just not quite enough <laughs> in hit points and stuff. I think that, I think the dodge rate on Mayu, though, gets crazy. Um, so as you go along, it just, you know, like you get, um, like Mayo gets super, uh, 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 the super ability to dodge and with thick fur, when you get the thick fur, it's like amazing for Mayo. All right. We've got the ceramic sword. So let's see if it's better to have the sword or the gun going back up against these guys. But first we have to find out how much how much it's gonna cost. <clears throat> these guys clearly is the you need the gun. Because it's just too good. Who's my favorite character? 
Um, that's a great question. Um, for me, I think ultimately it's Alice because, you know, like it's, it's a, you know, like your character that when I was growing up, you really, like, you didn't even like really kind of see the, the, you know, the character of Vengeaning their, their brother who was like fallen in battle kind of thing. Like I, I kind of dug that. I'm a, I'm a, like a main character kind of thing, but my favorite secondary character easily is Mayu because I mean, I also have never seen a game where you get a little kitty cat and it's your buddy. <laughs> it's, it's kind of cool. It's kind of cool. And it's like a party member in an RPG. Like that's, that's decent. I mean, there's Kate Sith later um, in Final Fantasy seven, but this, you know, like back in the eighties, I never saw anything like that. Um, is it this one? Is this the armor? Yeah. All right. Yes. Yeah. The Zer armor is a thousand. So that's, should be easy to get. If we go to Fishman land, it should be four sets of the big Fishman, and then we're in. So, I'm liking the fact that it's it's already getting to that point where we can just kind of just grind and get our stuff. That's great. I cannot wait to start Lunar because it's Oh, let's talk about grinding. I'm actually thinking about doing like a, like an all day or overnight grind, um, on a live stream, and just be like, I don't know, like, kind of like, kind of play it off like it's a like a lo-fi, you know, like a like a lo-fi for studying kind of thing, um, because I'm gonna try to do the tape trick on the controller, um, and uh, and try to do auto auto leveling with um, with the party once once you get, because you can basically get the full party together pretty early in lunar um and uh the auto motion like it you can there's a place where you can go in the very beginning of the game and basically send the party in a giant loop circle by just holding left and then you can hold down the the action button and it and actually yeah like it knows that you're you're trying to keep pushing over and over again so it does it for you so it's it's a uh, it's good times. Says you have facts. Nice. Nice. Oh Mayu. Mayu learned a spell. What did Mayu learn? Um oh Mayu learned cure. Mayu gets that at at uh at level six, which Maya should be just at, yep, at level six. Cool. Do -do -do. Oh, I need to pay attention to health. My bad. That was almost very, very poor. All right, magic. Uh, actually, uh, we're going to attack. Mayu can cure... Oh, not enough magic points. Um, oh, that's right, because we didn't, we didn't do that. I forgot. I forgot. That's fine. There we go. And it's and it's cure, not not a, uh, not that. The moto sur moto surgeon again. Uh, oh, um, didn't like the grinding in Fantasy Star Two. Yeah, I I heard that that was a that was a thing. I never actually got through Fantasy Star Two, because um, when it ha when it came to the Genesis. Um, that was when I made my, my, uh, my pivot. I played a whole bunch of master system and then, um, I got my Genesis and then immediately got a Sega CD. So, um, I didn't play fantasy star two or three or, or four. I went the other way and played shining force CD and lunar and then fell in love with lunar. I was like, Oh, there's another one of these lunar two. And then by that time, PlayStation was there, Final Fantasy 7, 8, 9, uh, Tactics, etc. Um, and that's how I went with the RPG journey. But I would love to go back, um, get a copy of... of uh, I'm probably going to Genesis... You know what? I'm probably going to get the Genesis module. Um, and then try to get my hands on some some of those classic RPGs. Um, put them on the Polymega and, and then do do completion quests on those later. Because so that'd be, that'd be cool. I love, I love these RPGs. Yeah, you know, like 
because then that it because it's just a like it, once you get into a rhythm if you're if you're good at the planning and the numbers and all that you can just sit around have a good time have people like get you guys hanging out in a chat um and then just play the game which is cool all right we need another heal Ooh, alice took that one in to the to the face I really need to open up the Polymega stuff as it's all here now. <laughs> and Television Gamer says. That's awesome. That's I mean Yes, you should, because it's it's really good. It's really good, man. Um I gotta get back and uh and, and clean up the uh the last of the fun for vibes too. On those games. I see some I see some people online too talking about specifically about the Polymega and those games that are like on or off um, of the Polymega. Um, some people saying like, ah, oh, well, you know, if they come back, it's it it's cool, but some of them not aren't, aren't that good. And then others are like, oh man, I really want to play those games again. It's kind of like a tug and tug and pull situation. And I'm like, eh. I like I like having them. And now that I know that I have them, I want to play them all before before I do lose them for a little bit. So we don't know when that new update's going to be coming out. Um, but apparently the teams are still working on everything. So I wonder if I'm there. Am I, am I there yet? Nope. 785. Close, though. So we'll go to, we'll go to 200 or 1,200. If we can, gotta watch my use health. Healing. Do it one more. All right, and then we can just go on through. I think it's another two, maybe. This must. Yeah, I think it's another two battles after this one. Because the last one got will get us close to a thousand, and this one should get us just over eleven hundred, which I think is what we need. Yeah, and then we'll probably get the extras on the way over the the shop. So, I mean, it's really not that bad. We're talking this is three total hours of gameplay, so you know, like at, in three total hours of gameplay, almost having everything you need, and with the third. I think I did it was like the third third best version of the armor, third best version of the sword, and third best version of the shield for both Odin and Alice. And then you're set for the rest of the game. You don't even need to buy anything else or, or do anything else until you pick up the weapons that are better. So like it's it's pretty crazy. Um and it's a well I think it's well worth it as far as the investment of time. Um uh, Immortal Surgeon asking, what hardware are you using to play this, SMS or Retron? We are playing on the Retron 5 using the Retron 5 3-in-1 adapter. Um, and it, this is the official SMS version. Um, courtesy of Phantom Fiction. Which was pretty cool. So we thank Phantom um, a whole bunch um, for shipping on over to this game, which was really, really cool to, to do. Um, I do, or I did, have two Sega Master Systems, um, in Studio A, the pre, the pre-days, pre-Studio A, original Studio A, um, and, uh, you know, unfortunately, after all the stuff happened, you know, I lost that, so, um, it was sad, that was a sad time, but, 
Um, the you know the retron is very convenient, you know, for for doing things. Um, so it's a pretty decent thing. However, the second they have any kind of SMS module for the Paul Omega, um, the retron is going to go to Studio B, and I'll probably just play games on a Paul Omega um, because you know I, I really really enjoy it. All right, so that's ceramic sword, ceramic armor, ceramic shield. Mayu is at level six. 913 experience. Uh, Mayu is about to level up. And Odin is at 1021. That's another 90 to level for him. And then he'll be at level nine, which is pretty crazy. This is, this is not bad. This Again, this is like an you know, hour and a half. After just getting these guys, oof, man, it's it's a it's a good it's a good time. Um, so let's go get that armor because we have enough. Um, oh, I need to let me just do this here. Let me just do the the magic, the magic of the heels, so I can make sure that we we can get across the the uh, the grass here. I mean, it should be fine, but also you just never know. Yep, Immortal Surgeon saying, yeah, big ups to fan of fiction. Good dude. He's he's awesome. He is absolutely awesome. And um, I actually do plan on as well, uh, in that same package, he, he uh, sent a couple of his books because um, he does some some fiction writing. Um, and I do plan on picking those uh, picking those up when I can and getting through them. And then, I don't know, maybe even do like a little like mini review. That'd be kind of cool. You know, check out all that stuff. But yeah, I mean, Phantom's awesome. As as are most, if not all. Well, I mean, everybody, everybody that's everybody that comes in is awesome. Um, you know, to to chat because I always love you know, um, I always love uh, hanging out with everybody. Oh, sweet! I ordered this book from Amazon. It should be arriving tomorrow. Yeah, man. That's very cool. Very, very cool. Alright, 26 Mesitas. Oh. Come on, main eater, man. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, yeah, we still need to get to a thousand more just so that we can get to the next thing that we need to do. Ooh, Mayu, Mayu got that level. Um, which means if Mayu got that level, that's 950. Yeah, we should be getting close for uh, for Odin there. And now let's get the armor. Boom. No, I don't hit anymore. Item. Armor, equip, Odin. Now let's go to the stats on Odin. Yeah. Yeah, buddy. Yeah, the 41 de attack is because he's got the gun still, but 80 defense, that's a good time. Alice is rocking 121 defense. Man, that's that's pretty good too. Um but we need the thick fur for Mayu because 45 defense isn't. <laughs> it's just not cutting it for her poor, poor kitty cat. Um, yeah, level 7, 957, um, 1150 is the next. So just a thousand, uh, 100, 100 XP to level 8 uh, for Mayu. So we're, again, pretty little time investment and big ups. So. What's going on over to the Canamites? Get our saves going on. And then I think what we're going to do is we're going to try to change the strategy. We'll take the needle gun off and then see if I can get through the fishman's either quicker or safer. But I'm not sure. I'm not sure that's the case. The needle gun might actually be like better to have on hand even though it doesn't do as much damage. All right. Item. 
equip Odin. So both Alice at level 13 and Odin now have the third best weapon and armor set in the game. And we're at like three hours plus. How crazy is that? All right. I remember traveling the spaceship for the first time. It was blown away. Pretty much all the vehicles are cool. Yeah, I, I agree. I agree. Well, especially for me, because it, it was just after we get to the point where um, in the previous episode of this show, um, I I had the thing where I didn't know what that I had to talk to the road pass guy for three times in a row. So I just walked around Palma for a, like a full calendar year plus, year and a half at least, maybe even two. Um, just level building with Alice because I didn't know what, to, know what else to do. Which is nuts. So, yeah, it's it's pretty wild. But yeah, as soon as I saw that though, the first time, it, it that was pretty cool. All right, so let's go out here. <laughs> yeah, yeah, lol, for sure, man. Um, yeah, I could I couldn't believe it. I was just like, yeah, you got to talk to him three times. Come on, man. Yeah, see, that would have been a twice. Because of the of the five hit for Odin, I don't know if Mayu can take him out at once. Oh, nice! See, Mayu's getting a little sharp when we're getting to this level. All right, we're at Fishman. Oh, this is the, and this is like the big one too. So, so we'll see. Odin, wow, that was a huge hit. It was a huge hit. Oh, that's such a bummer. There we go. Couldn't take that down. Come on, guys. Come on, guys. Yeah, Maya's getting smacked up, but it's not really that bad. As long as Maya is the first one. Alright, that's not too bad either. Still not bad. Maya's got a lot of magic points, too. Nice. Odin advanced the level, so that means he just hit 1100 and level 9. 1100 total points. <clears throat> Very good. Nice. Let's see who took that. Who took that spear? Looks like it was Mayu. That's fine. That's another huge one. We'll just watch health here. If Mayu gets under 20. Then it's heal time. Do, 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 do. 
Holding strong. Oh, <laughs> what a bummer. There we go. Alright, so let's see where we're at Masuda's wise. 947. Alright. So we definitely got there. Um, let's, let's do the magic. We'll heal up Mayu. We'll do it. We'll do that twice. We give two to Odin as well. No, just the one. And then we'll go until I'm running out of magic from Alice to heal. We'll just keep go we'll just keep running and see where we go. We'll probably pick up maybe another level. Um, and definitely enough Mesitas to to last. So we won't have to grind anymore. Because the next thing we're gonna have to do is go into that one cave up top. And try to get the uh, the strawberry cake. We might actually be able to even just do that right now. Before we get on out of here. Let's see where the... Uh, put this over here. Gonna watch the health too. Do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do
So we're gonna go all the way up here now. Moto Surgeon says, I appreciate the artists who put together the art for this game. So amazing. I absolutely agree. This was this was actually, I mean, in my opinion, this is a stellar achievement as far as 8-bit gaming goes. Um, just kind of bar none. Yeah, you know, like there's a lot of really good good looking games on most systems, you know, NES, you know, Sega Master System, all that kind of stuff. But you know, this if you were gonna create a list of like best looking 8-bit games of all time. Um, you have to include this one in this in a list, you know. And anyone that doesn't, I think, is just being silly. We're almost to the cave. Got some owl bears. <clears throat> I'm pretty sure I bought another flash, didn't I? I bought a second flash, didn't I? That would be really silly. Yeah, I got a flash. Good. Because it's about to get dark. <laughs> Item. Got to use the dungeon key to open the door. Nope. Okay. And then we go over here, down the stairs. Then we go, what is A? A is a short sword, don't need that. Two is the, wait, what's this? So we gotta, gotta look at it this way. Gotta remember these maps are different. All right, here we go. We dodged it. Yeah, get out of here. Okay, and we go this way. And then we go this way. And then we go gold lens. Do 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 do. Go down there. Basement three. Now we've got to go straight across around the corner. Hook a left. Hook a basement three. And now we're in basement four. So now we're going towards here. And then we need the doorway for the guy that's in the cave that wants to sell you things. So there's that. That's this way. I'm sorry I have a shop in such a place. Shortcake for a thousand mesitas. Yes. Thanks, come again. I wonder if he just... Ah. Okay. So I guess you just keep buying shortcakes. But we got the cake. That's all we need. Um, so do we have... Magic. No. Yeah, we don't have any. We don't have any way of getting out of here, so we got to walk our way out, which is fine. Uh, 
Um, three. This way. Do 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 do. Oh, whereabouts? Man, if we saw that, saw these like anywhere lower level, this would be ridiculous. Thirty three experience points. Odin get Odin leveled up. So is that ten for him? Ten or eleven? That's wild. Oh, hello. Not want to let us out of here. We gotta remember the uh, there's that item that gets you out of a dungeon. We should probably the escaper, I think, is what it's called. Should probably have a couple of those in the inventory so we can get on out of this place when we need to. Since we're gonna be doing so much grinding, I mean, right now I'm not. I don't mind it too much because. Yeah, we could use the XP and, and the Mesitas going by. Apparently, you don't need um, a thousand total. You need a thousand total in your inventory in order to buy it, but he didn't charge us a thousand Mesitas to buy the, the thing. Ooh, who took that? Looks like Mayo again. Poor kitty cat. Right. Oh! Mayu learned a spell. So that means Mayu must have learned terror, which means Mayu is at level 9. Pretty good. Do, 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 do. is Mayu at? Now we are at, let's just check it out, level 9, yep, 1449 XP, next level is 1700, so, I mean, we're trucking along, Odin, level 10, Alice, level 14, we're, we're doing it, this is good times, all right, Let's get on back to Kamit. Get the easy heal. I think that's that's it for now. Well, and then I'll go ahead and double check the stories and stuff, and see what the plan of attack is for for the for the next time. I think what I really want to do is now that we're here, we've got everything we need to move on with the story. We don't need to be in Palma anymore, so we have to go over to the desert planet and then we have to find our way to go get noah um 
So I think that's the next push. The push is the quest for Noah. Um, so uh, this is man. That's gonna be a while before um, Mayo learns. Ex oh yeah, yeah. Mayo doesn't get that until level seventeen. So yeah, we're 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 a ways out. That's okay though. It'll be all right. All right, we're in Kamit. Do do do. All right, what do we got here? 132, 70, 94. Yeah, we get, we're we're totally good for doing some more grinding, um, and we're in excellent shape. So we'll we'll go over and check some stuff out here. Yep. All right, so we saved. Yeah, we got Alice at level 14, 65 attack, 128 defense, which is good. We got way more than enough Mesitas. Um, we've got the following spells, of course, too. Heal by chat, fire rope. Um, what's Alice's next one? Uh, fly in two levels. Uh, she'll learn fly, which means then I don't need uh, Transer because fly will take you. Um, it's basically a Transer that you can use. Uh, magic core. Um, okay, status Mayu, level nine, cure terror. Um, Odin doesn't get any magic, but level ten, looking good times. All right, awesome. Oh, well, let me go back in here because I always like leaving it that way. All right, awesome. I think we're good. We're good to go there. We're gonna put this one. The now the cave, courtesy of Starfighter76. Thanks again for your efforts. Um, I'm gonna put that in the in the pile there. I'm gonna put the Palma world map up on top of that too. So we'll need that when we get when we get there. We'll organize these. All right, cool. Well, let's go over to the wrap up and talk a little bit more and then get out of here. All right, sweet. Let's go. All right, my fine fantasy star friends, we have officially gotten through a whole bunch of stuff. We partied up. We got Mayu. We got Odin. Then we hooked up Odin with the third and fourth best armor, shield, and weapon in the game. Excellent times. Then we did all the requirements left in Palma, getting the shortcake, the dungeon key, and all of that kind of stuff. Um, making it ready to continue on our journey. So we're we're in great, great shape right now. And it's all thanks to Phantom Fiction and you guys helping me out. And, of course, Starfighter76 for those awesome maps. And let me just go and make sure I, I start remembering this person that wrote the guide um, here for Fantasy Star because um, this, this guy is pretty awesome too. Dark Vortex on the Game Facts. So thank you for all of those things. Um, all right. So what we're doing now, what is the next thing we're going to do? Uh, we went to the Nala cave. I uh, thought whatever. Um, that's fine. Uh, ready to go to the Palma spaceport again um, and fly to Matavia. Enter Peso and step into the gray, gray building protected by two dozing guards. All right, sweet. So then we're doing it. We're doing the thing. All right, awesome. Then we're going to have that weird like battle with the the succubus it's it's like a fake battle you're supposed to it's supposed to kill you but we actually might be powerful enough to, to take it down so we'll see we'll see what happens all right guys well if you're in the comments leave some comments below uh let me know how how uh you're feeling about this whole thing um you know how how are you feeling about the journey um and if you guys are here in the chat of course leave some more comments anytime i am live streaming um every chat will just We'll pop up and we'll talk about it and we'll talk with with you guys as we're playing, which is awesome. This is exactly the reason why um, completion quest exists. I love going through these games and chatting with you as we're going. And of course, now that we are at an end of a video here on Bacon Ice Cream Productions, we have to do one thing, one thing only, and that's thank every single member of the Good Times Club. So let's thank the Ever Canadian, Crimson Cross, George Games, Chris Westerman, Phantom Fiction, Skeletrex, Lid Arjun, Papa Pete, the Intellivision Gamer, Ken LeCure, Mr. Shua, John Willig, Gunsy20, and Immortal Soldier, who was also right here in the chat as we were streaming. 
which is going to be really cool. So, anyway, thanks everyone for watching. We will catch you next time for some more Completion Quest action right here. I'm Rich, and we will see you later. Take it easy, guys. Team RTSC.BakeItIceCream.com